Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Sormisha Patel and today in this video we are going to discuss on the row banding. So this row banding is mainly the alternate color bands that we can see on this row wise. So that is called the row banding. But we'll understand what are the Tableau standards for formatting and how you can improve the readability of all the fields which we use within this text table or anywhere you use. But mainly whenever you create a text table, you find such kind of a row banding as a default Tableau standards. So let's see how to remove it or how to enhance the view. So as you can see, this is my um, uh, this text table that I've created based on the gender and ethnicity and these numbers uh, as you can see the measured fields they are the number of education counts um, so uh, these are about based on the gender and the woman so what you see is these color bands which are uh, row wise they are showing they are showing in terms of um, in every alternate with the grayish and shade so uh, this is common for the whole row but let's say I just want only uh, for specific let's say just for the gender or let's say just for making sure that uh, in specific gender it show uh, those color bands. So how to increase or uh, improve that readability. So for that right click anywhere on this text table that you have created on the sheet and then go to the format and uh, to uh, see on this row banding side for that click on the shading so format shading and in that you will find this one of uh, the row banding there are two type or, or let's say there are the two controls one is a pane and the header so what exactly this header would be header would be the uh, these as you can see these are the headers ethnicity actually belong to the header what it comes to the pane is these numbers so let's see one by one what are exactly what i'm trying to tell you so when in pane let's say i'm changing this with light pink in color so you will see all those colors where wherever it was a gray right now have changed this measured field with light pink in color and if i say for the header uh, it's quite obvious but let's say if i choose something as this um peach color so this orange peach color is actually giving for just for the ethnicity so how this comes up so if you can see this band size and the level size the band size you can increase decrease kind of you can do it so what this increase and decrease is if you say the level if you choose this it makes that for every other alternate this color bands is created if i choose the other uh, the third selection of the band size which means that every two uh, rows you can have these colors if i choose the fourth band size which means that every uh, three rows just except that first three rows it has the color so every other three rows there is an alternate other three rows you have this color band so uh, so band size means the number of um, rows has been increased by its level and uh, instead of alternate it uh, makes the difference of those many number of rows what you choose as the size so uh, if uh, so right now it's showing just for uh, until one two three four five six so six one that means uh, for every fifth um, every five rows uh, in every next of the five rows so from the sixth row uh, the next fives are being colored with that uh, header or the pane that with that uh, row banding so that's how the uh, band size works so i'll go with the default one which is this where every alternate one but if i see the level so what exactly this level functionality would be right now it's giving you the level at the ethnicity but let's say if i change and make it somewhere over here then the level it will be based on the gender so that's how it increase or improve the readability that on what basis on on what level you want to have this row banding so whichever the first uh, field that you have put on this pane where in gender is the first so that means that the level one and the level two would be the ethnicity by default it is uh, it was showing us the ethnicity level that is the second row uh, if i add any other further then you can have more levels to it let's say i give it a try 
uh, I hope it it does not ruin everything but yeah if you see this level and if I again right click over here and go to the format on the shading and you will see the level level has been improved one two so if I go on second then it will choose based on the ethnicity if I choose the first level then means it is based on the gender wise so that's how you can increase and improve the readability using the row banding you can also remove that row banding just by making it none select the none from there and you can have the normal without the row banding so that's how you can improve our um, the uh, readability at the same time you can work around and create your own design and the layout and the color combination just to improve the readability so this is uh, about the row banding uh, we'll see uh, on the next video about the column banding i hope you like this video and our formatting series tableau formatting series and for more such video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any questions please write down in the comment section i'll try to um, answer all your questions as soon as possible till then happy learning we'll see you on the next video